Out there at sea, visibility can change in seconds. One moment everything's clear and the next, you can barely see the bow of your ship. But even when our eyes can't see, the ship still can, thanks to radar. This system helps mariners detect dangers miles away using nothing but radio waves and echoes. In this video, let's talk about how radar actually works and why it's one of the most important tools in navigation. The word radar stands for radio detection and ranging. It sounds technical, but the concept is simple. Just like how sound bounces off a wall and creates an echo, radar uses radio waves that bounce back when they hit an object. By listening to those echoes, radar helps us detect what's out there, even when we can't see it with our eyes. How radar works. Here's how it works. The radar sends out a short burst of electromagnetic energy. When it hits an object like another ship or a coastline, part of that energy reflects back. Since the speed of radio waves is known, the radar calculates how far the object is by measuring how long it takes for the echo to return. The shorter the pulse, the easier it is to separate targets that are close together. Radar serves two main functions on board. First, it acts as an aid to prevent collisions, allowing us to see through fog, darkness or rain. Second, it serves as a navigational aid, helping identify coastlines, buoys or islands, especially useful in coastal and congested waters. Radar operates using radio waves, a type of electromagnetic energy made up of crests and troughs, like waves on the sea. The wavelength is the distance between two crests, and the frequency is how many crests pass a point each second. When the frequency is high, the wavelength is short, and when the frequency is low, the wavelength is long. These two always go hand in hand. Most ships use two radar bands, X-band and S-band. X-band radar operates around 10 gigahertz with a 3 centimeter wavelength. It gives a sharper image, perfect for detecting small targets and for close range navigation. However, it's more affected by rain and sea clutter and has a shorter range. S-band radar, on the other hand, runs at 3 gigahertz with a 10 centimeter wavelength. It's great for long-range detection and performs better in rain, fog and rough seas. But the image is less detailed and it requires a larger antenna. And that's the basic principle behind radar. So next time you see that antenna spinning on a ship's mast, remember, it's more than just a turning dish. It's the ship's eyes, constantly scanning the horizon to keep everyone safe. A simple idea, radio waves and echoes, yet it saves countless lives at sea every single day. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you won't miss more maritime lessons here on Maritime Academia.